Hi, David here. Today we're going to talk about understanding your level of financial commitment. We all love a feel-good story, which is why the modern day business world seems full of gung-ho tech startups that were up to their eyeballs in debt before a lucky break bailed them out. But for every Jeff Bezos who warned early Amazon investors there was a 70% chance they'd never see their money again, there are countless entrepreneurs who overextend themselves before crashing and burning into obscurity. The safer bet for small business owners is to be well aware of your financial commitments and limits so you can focus on running a business that boasts a healthy cash flow. Small businesses are very vulnerable to changes in market conditions, loss of major clients and issues with funding staff. It is very important to identify each risk, calculate the financial implications and verify the sustainability of the business on an ongoing basis. Cash flow is probably number one problem businesses cite when they're in tax trouble. A small business owner who learns about their cash flow, how to map it regularly and take action when necessary can avoid having cash flow issues. The more digitally advanced a small business is, the more likely it is to be on top of its tax obligations. Here's how the ATO recommends businesses plan for regular financial commitments in five simple steps. Number one. Business activities. Know which of your business activities trigger tax obligations. Number two, important dates. Know the dates these obligations are due and then set reminders. Number three, gather your figures. Adopt good record keeping practices and regularly estimate the cost of your obligations so you're not caught short. Number four, set aside funds. Use multiple business accounts and regularly move the estimated cost of obligations into each holding account. This will help ensure the money is ready when you need it and help separate your business finance from your personal finance. Number five, pay on time. Take advantage of discounts or other benefits by paying on time. Keep keep a close eye on your financial obligations. As a small business owner, it can be tempting to focus on other sexier parts of your business, the marketing, the networking, the graphic design, and the website tinkering. However, Too many businesses overlook the importance of cash flow, budgeting and planning. And by the time it's finally caught their attention, it can be too late. It's vital that businesses budget their cash flows monthly for at least 12 months ahead. Once you understand your cash flow, then you'll have the information you need to focus on various various other aspects of your business such as funding, advertising, cost savings, recruiting more staff or negotiating with your suppliers. Let us know what you think.